Hey, what up guys? This is Right Trigger and you're watching pre-recorded gameplay of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Now this is not um, a gameplay, obviously. This is just a cutscene, but I will be talking about everything when it comes to zombies, what I love about it, uh, what you can do. Not everything, everything, because I can't just think of you know everything you can do in Call of Duty off the top of my head, being that I don't have any kind of script. Um, but I will tell you that it is by far one of my most favorite parts of Call of Duty now, <laughs> even though there's only like four things you can do. Um, now, the uh, the first thing I wanted to talk about is uh, Exo Survival. Now, Exo Survival, if you guys know, is basically zombies, except you're, instead of going against zombies, you're going against people, and you're the last one left, and if, spoiler alert, I will let you know that. So, for the next minute, you might want to mute your uh, your thing. Anyways, uh, on the fourth tier, on the 11th game, you actually... Uh, you, you get to play a little bit of zombies. Now, the zombies look nothing, 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 nothing like the zombies in... Uh, well, you know, the zombie mode in Advanced Warfare. But it is similar in a way. The zombies do move in the same way, and they're just about as fast as the, zo the zombies mode. Um, and it kind of introduces you, like in this cutscene, even though it's about to be over, in this cutscene it kind of introduces you to the characters, well not really the characters, but what's going to be happening. Because you're the last one left, all of a sudden the giant DNA bomb exploded, and you are the only one who really survives out of your group, or at least that's how the game tried to make it seem. Um, that is if you played it with, you know, friends. If you played it by yourself, then you were the only one who made it out, and you were the only one who were playing, who was playing. So, yeah, I just thought I'd throw that out there. Exo Survival was the uh, the intro to zombies, um, and even though that's just a theory, it's pretty damn obvious. I don't need to go on IGN and say. Uh, is, is zombies, is, or is survival the beginning of, of zombies? Is, is that it? Because you really don't need to make the connection. It's pretty damn obvious. Um, so, I'm just letting you know that it is absolutely for sure that survival is the beginning of zombies. If you haven't played survival, I would recommend it. Get a good group of friends, you know, uh, people who are in your skill level, and just go into survival and wreck. Me and my friends got to um, round uh, three, or what the hell? No, we got to round um, 22 cubed. And if you guys don't understand that, that is technically speaking round 72. Because 25, and then another 25, and then 22. If you add that up, that equals 72. Or something like that. <laughs> um, now, that that's not exactly what the video is going to be about, but I just put that in there just because this is going to be a longer video and um, I already know that because the way my stuff is set up. I know it down to the last frame. <laughs> it's going to be on the 21st frame of the 54th second. If you want to know that for some reason. Anyways, back to the review. I love, I love, 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 love zombies. Now, I've only played it for roughly... 24 hours now, just about, just about 24 hours, being that I actually got the Havoc DLC, uh, what is the date, just for those who are watching it, uh, later on than when it's being uploaded, I got it on the 24th of February, it came out the 27th of January, I only was able to get it a month after it came out, only because I didn't have the money yet, I just had to gather up the money for that, which really wasn't that bad. Um, just so you guys know, in case any of you uh, have a question about why you're unable to download the Havoc DLC, I'm going to be posting a video about um, this thing where it says um, you're unable to buy uh, any further, like, you know, game stuff or whatnot um, because you have reached your limited amount of, of uh, you know, uh, items you can buy. There is a trick around there. It's not really a trick, but they're very, very stupid, and they don't know how to describe things correctly. So I'm just letting you guys know if the, if you're watching this later on, there is now a video on my channel 
um, describing how to get past this. It's very, very easy to fix. Don't even worry about it. You can get past this. Um, so go ahead and check out my channel, and uh, it should be basically it should be named uh, similar to what I just said. Anyways, um, if you <laughs> if you played Black Ops 2 Zombies or Black Ops 1 Zombies, I'm letting you know right now this is not nothing like it, but it's. It's not similar enough <laughs> to be considered like it at all. Um, the fact that they have the exo suits, it kind of makes them way, like, they're really, really, really fast. The zombies in this game are very fast, so if you're trying to reload or something, make sure you've got the exo reload, which, uh, if you played Black Ops 2, is speed cola. Um, same difference. That is a difference I wanted to mention in uh, my review because I found it to be very, very weird that they changed the names until I figured out that Treyarch actually copyrighted, uh, or copyright? I don't know how you'd say that. Anyways, they, they, you know, copyrighted, I'm just gonna say it like that. They copyrighted their, their zombies. So you. That's kind of the reason why uh, Ghost, well that is the reason why Ghost didn't have zombies, and that's the reason why Advanced Warfare is so much different when it comes to zombies. The, um, the Juggernaug is now called Exo Health, uh, what is this right here? This is Exo something, uh, Exo Medic, and Exo Medic is, uh, just Quick Revive, that's all it is. And, um, Exo Reload, that's, uh, like I just said, Speed Cola, um, and there's just, there's so many different things, and they're all just based off of uh, Black Ops 2. Like, there's, um, so I don't remember the name for uh, Instakill, but Instakill is like some odd name, and there's all these different kinds of things. Power Sale uh, is one of them th from Black Ops 1. Power Sale was a thing, and they brought it back in Advanced Warfare, but they called it like uh, Power Surge or something like that. It's really, really weird, but it's, it's cool. I, I like it. Um, I like that they brought back a lot of the same things from like Black Ops 1 and brought it into Advanced Warfare. I think that was a smart decision um, on Sledgehammer's um, part. <laughs> so, anyways, back to what I... Uh, back to Actually, we don't even need to say back to whatever because we were right on topic. Yay for me. <laughs> um, if you are looking for something that's very close to Black Ops 2, you might want to try this out. But if you're looking for kind of a new experience, uh, you know, new map, uh, all that kind of, you know, cool stuff, and <laughs> 3D printer, and uh, exosuit, and exozombies, different kind of zombies, oh, and I'll be talking about that in a second, I would recommend buying Advanced Warfare, uh, because the Havoc DLC is very, very good when it comes to this, you know, the, um, when it comes to zombies. This is zombies is one of my favorite uh, or, okay, Advanced Warfare Zombies is by far one of my favorites. Now, the gun that you're looking at right here, this is a 3D printing gun. It's called the IMR. And pretty much what it does is it's a four-shot burst, as you can hear in the audio, uh, and see. It's a four-shot burst, but you can never run out of ammo. Because every four seconds, it's creating four more bullets. Now, that's a bullet per second, but it only adds up once the four seconds are gone. Or, or have gone by, I should say. Um, what was it that I was saying I was going to talk about? You know what? I'm probably going to look at this when I uh, uh, before I upload it, because I always do. And uh, realize, holy crap, I made a mistake by not talking about that. But whatever it was, it was probably a lie, so <laughs> never mind on that. Um, I'll probably bring it up in my next video or something. Um... Yeah, no, I can't remember. Anyways, I'm going to leave you guys with the rest of this video. I do end up dying, and this is like round 20... 21? Um, so, I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you uh, want want to see some specific video, or see me like use specific guns in Zombies, let me know. Leave your you know thoughts and opinions on uh, in the comments, and make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you, if you enjoyed, even though I already said to comment. Anyways, <laughs> that's all I got for you guys today, and... Interesting. I'll see you guys in the next one. Please. So, were the objectives met? No, there's more work to be done. Initiate phase two.